Merry Christmas everyone! It's that time of the year again where everyone's greeting each other Christmas greetings. Let's just quickly look back at the very first Christmas greeting. Some shepherds were on night duty and lo and behold an angel turns up and he says, I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all people. So he brings good news that will cause great joy, not just joy, we can experience joy quite easily, but he brings great joy. Something has happened that will cause great joy, not just for the shepherds, not just for a few people, but for all people. That's why we say Merry Christmas to each other. What happened? Today in the town of David, a saviour has been born to you. That's what the angel tells. And then more angels join in and they proclaim the greatness of God. So what has this saviour to do with great joy? Later on in Luke chapter 2, we read, after the baby was born, he was taken to the temple to be consecrated. And Simeon, a prophet, comes and says to the parents, Joseph and Mary, For my eyes have seen your salvation, which you have prepared in the sight of all nations, a light for revelation to the Gentiles and the glory of your people Israel. So we see here why it's great joy for all people, because salvation has been prepared in this baby for all nations which is why the great joy that jesus has brought is not just for a few it's for everyone it's for all mankind this happened over two thousand years ago and this is reason for great joy even today so once again whatever situation you're going through whether you have a joyous Christmas season or you don't. Merry Christmas because Jesus brings great joy. I pray that you will experience great joy no matter what your day is like today. God bless.